Gina Resurrection. Chuck Heaton. Gabriel Mejia. Tina Green. I am a single mother and I work. I got a wife and four kids, so I'm busy. I've been playing bike polo for about seven years. Started riding a bike out here, got involved in the community. I uh, heard about bike polo, came out and played the first time and I got hooked. Started playing in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, and then moved to Austin, Texas, and played there. And then I moved to Mobile, Alabama, and played there, and now I'm here. I didn't realize it was so big here. I started playing bike polo in 92, grass bike polo was where I started. It's competitive, it's a lot of fun, you drink beer, you meet really cool people. Think of it as soccer, but on a bike with a mallet. I fell in love with it as a teenager and I've done it in some form ever since. It's a challenge because um, people are used to riding a bike with two hands on the handlebars. With bike polo, you ride with one hand because your other hand is with the melon. There is some very clean play, very awesome teamwork, and then there is some dirty play, and sometimes things don't go as planned. So you just have to throw with the game. Probably more crashing in grass bike pole than, than hardcore bike pole because you have a bigger space to get more speed. You're using the front brake, and when you start and you just slam on that front brake and you don't know what's going on, you don't brace yourself, you're flying right onto the frame of the bike. Falling sucks, but it's just part of the game. Bike pole, I think, is a lot about positioning and then, uh, and then passing as well. The whole purpose of the game is to score five points or to score more points than the other opposing team at the end of the time, which is 10 minutes. You play every position. You play offense, you play defense, you play goal. Some players are a little bit, you know, a little bit more skilled and score a little bit more. Some, some players, you know, everyone has a strength in the It's definitely a challenge, because uh, you got to balance. You, your foot lands on the ground, you have to go hit the side of the wall to get back into the game. You make a shot, it has to be with the end of the mallet. You can't push it in. You're focusing on so much, so you got to be able to be very observant and uh, multitask. I'm a pretty competitive person, so when I step on the court, if you're not on my team, you're not my friend. Bike polo is one of the funnest sports you can try on a bicycle. And I love it. 